Hi. Hi. So I, I called your room like you requested, and you didn't answer the phone. Yeah, no, um, I answered. Had, no, the, 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 the second and third time. Yeah. Okay, so, so what's your name? reach out to you guys, Megan. Megan who? I don't need to give you my last name. Megan Griffin? No, that's not my name. That's not your name? No. And what's your name? Christina. Christina. Okay. And Did what's your role? Did reach out to you guys? No. What is your role here at the hotel? I'm the senior guest service manager. Guest service manager. Mm -hmm. Okay. And your role? Housekeeping assistant manager. Housekeeping assistant manager. Mm -hmm. Okay. If you don't want to be recorded, you can stand behind me. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. All right. So Did we've Expedia been here a month. No, I'm, I'm, I'm going to talk now. So we've been here a month. Did Expedia reach out to you guys? All right. So at this point, we have rights. So if you want to violate those rights, you can continue in your actions. That's okay. Did Expedia reach out to you guys about relocation? No. Okay, so they should be reaching out. So we have our reservation. We've been here a long time. That's okay. You have no reason to kick us out. You've made every, almost every single member so of the staff feel uncomfortable with your being here. With so your refusal to we put don't on even, clothes. we don't even come with out your, of our room. That's okay. With you your barged in our room while I was okay. naked. I'm okay. I'm okay. You don't you have too. permission that's to come in here. Hotel. I pay for here. I pay for okay. this room. It's our hotel. So as we long as I right pay for this room, service. I have That's okay. full authority to say do not walk in this room. This this sign. That's okay. It says privacy, please. I understand. I understand. Do, do you know what privacy means? Okay, so now we're refusing so service for you. So it means don't come in our room without That's calling. I, I didn't come in. Okay, you did I several did times. I did not. You. Me personally staff. did not. You're you and you're in your okay. staff. So barge into our room several times okay. and because we complain so about that you to leave so and if you don't want to leave i'm just going to call houston pd and they'll come escort you off the property so it's all being that's okay it's all it's, it's all going to be know. in the lawsuit that's all right okay. so that's okay. however you feel you should continue that's please okay. be so my guest has expedia reached out about relocation once again no okay so i'll call so them again to make sure that they reach we out we didn't give you. any permission or consent for that's you to change our reservation that's or cancel okay. our reservation that's okay. okay we don't need your consent so to cancel the reservation leave me alone okay okay whatever cult you're a member of i'm uh, no leave us alone that's not the all thing all right okay we knew you were coming to harass us that's okay it's all documented and nobody's harassing you're you. being streamed live the whole world is watching you that's okay okay Okay. I just want you to know that. So I'm going to call Houston PD. Megan. Are you refusing to leave? So we, we're paid. Our, our room's paid for. Okay. Are you refusing we're to tenants. leave today? Are you refusing we to leave today? We have tenant rights. Are you refusing to leave today? So do what you got to do. No, I'm, I'm asking a question. So are you refusing to leave today? Are you evicting us? Yes. So you have to go through court to do that. No, we don't. It's a hotel. Yeah. It's not we've a apartment. We've been here. We've been here long enough to be tenants. That's you don't have one okay. solid reservation. That's so thirty days at you a can time, prove so it. it doesn't qualify you as a tenant. So we've been here long enough to be qualified to be as tenants. a tenant. It has to be a continuous no, it doesn't. One thirty day reservation. No, it doesn't. Yes, it does. No, it doesn't. Okay. Show me that in law. Put it in writing and give it to me. That's okay. I will just. Okay. We have the right to so, refuse service, and so I'll call Houston PD. Whoever you're gonna call we'll is gonna tell you the same law. So I will wait. No, they won't. That's okay. We're gonna see. Go see. Okay. We'll see. We're gonna see. Thank you. See what I told y'all? As soon as I start sharing my videos online. I start getting harassed, stalked, threatened. They create a controversy so they can call the police. So we'll be back with part two. Just a moment. Hello, how are you doing? I'm good. good. How are you? Good here. All right now. Okay, uh, the reason we're here is because the hotel staff called us and uh, you guys are no longer. Can you please take out your hands out of your pocket? Oh, uh, it's just my phone. Okay. Uh, you guys are no longer wanted here and uh, they're going to refund you your $50. Tonight. The tonight, and we'll give you the cash deposit. And, 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 all right, what's your name? Jose Salazar. Jose Salazar. Yes, sir. What's your badge number, Salazar? Supervisor, and uh, what's your name? What's your name, sir? Well, we give you names. Well, well, I'll, I'll give you money. I just want okay, to get it on the record. My name's my name's Ken. Kenny. Yeah. 
I'm Officer Roseboro. Roseboro? Yes. Your badge number? 6096. 6096. All right. We've been here a month. So technically we're tenants. And out of nowhere... This is a hotel. It's not an apartment. Well, it's a condo. So out of nowhere, they're telling us we can't extend anymore. We haven't been getting given any notice. We were never giving any notice of any violation or anything like that. Yes. Uh, she so, and um, so the manager has asked y'all. So what? What? Leave already? You guys refuse to leave. So Supervisor Salazar, okay, this is, this is, this is, this is I'd like to okay, appoint you on. fiduciary trustee and commend you to provide me for remedy in this matter. Listen, listen to me. Listen to me. Okay. If you guys do not leave, we're going to call the Harris County District Attorney's Office. Okay, here's a manager right here. Can you tell me what yep. you need to know? So you haven't been here for 30 so days. Just hold on, listen. All right. Listen. Your first reservation is on December 17th. That does not make you here for 30 days. You are, it's not a continuous reservation, so it's a check-in and check-out. So technically you are checking in and checking out every day, so there's no 30-day continuous reservation. Not the only reason that we rights. did that that's okay. is because you started charging us $50 a day and that's okay. extra and we, and we waive for, ex we waive for our, every room. our protocols for you to, con to, to uh -huh. make sure that we weren't, because our protocol is 50 days for the first day and $40 for each additional day. We waive that protocol for you. Which, which, so which means we couldn't pay for our month at one time or else we would have been charged $40 times 28 days. That's no, irrational. It, stops, it caps it to 90 that's so that's irrational so here's my okay. question it doesn't matter what I'm, so, I'm talking now. here's my question so I'm talk why are we being asked talk. to leave that well, is my only have, question my question the, the answer to that question is that you have made every employee here feel uncomfortable in any encounter we never come out of our you. room so how is that's that okay so we based on a hotel you've had your dnd but every third day we're required to knock on the door and inspect the room to ensure that one there's no damages that all of the guests are safe nobody's hurt or damaged in the room and that's our protocol so for so the first third two day, weeks you never asked to do that yes they do every third day and then when they come into the room no you guys we were here two weeks okay, before anyone I'm listening. Okay, I'm listening so i'm listening i'm listening to a debate we're not i don't debate. I, I don't want to debate me. okay i'm just asking okay. why yes sir yes are we sir. Being but here what i'm trying to tell you leave. let me explain something may i speak yes let me explain something to you the process that's what's what's about to happen okay all right and and where you want to go and wherever you need to go that's going to be a uh, a civil suit yes. right now we here for a law enforcement uh, matter the management so, listen to me in sir violation you, uh, of Texas you don't code want, title 13 ma'am 2155 sir, whatever that is listen to me they want you to leave that's the law you need to leave okay we're tenants okay um, you're not okay tenants. listen okay we're through with talking we can call the district attorney's office and, and do what and you're gonna get arrested for, for trespassing for what for refusing to leave okay are you gonna leave sir so y'all need to pack up your stuff. This all started because they no. came in. No, 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 we're not here. We're not here. It's not debating, man. Why are y'all wasting y'all boys at me? This yeah. is my first time ever talking. Okay, ma'am, listen to me. Like, okay, I've been standing here this time. But, 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 uh, uh, your pockets, my, my, my hand's not in my pocket. Just keep my pockets. Right? No, I'm pulling my pants okay. up because they're falling down. Well, however you want to. All right, so we don't have a problem even. This is all okay. just for the record. Okay. All right? And it's also on the record that, you know, I did appoint you for the sheriff trustee and you could not provide me remedy as that <coughs> judiciary trustee. Sure. So okay. we're going to okay. pack our bags. Okay. And um, please, we're going to stay right here at the door. Very dishonorable. Your bags, you know, okay. you should always keep your oath. Okay. I'm trying to where, pack. Where I'm trying from? to pack right now. Yeah, where are you guys from? Where's your idea? I don't have ID. You don't have ID. No. You don't have no ID. No, we were here no in the ID. flood. We lost all of our stuff. Okay, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to even get this room if someone didn't have an ID. Listen, listen, listen. I'm trying to pack up, brother. Okay. Like I go to the look, closet look, for putting my It's behind you. My bag's behind you. Can I get to it? Yeah, go ahead. Like, I just I'm gonna keep an eye on folks for my safety as well as yours. Well, no, I mean we're not criminals, man. We're tenants. <laughs> we're tenants, man. Yes, ma'am. Look how we're being treated. Like criminals, man. We can't even pack up. You wanna pack for us? We got big bags. We need a cart downstairs. Can can Yeah, can we get a cart? All right. She's calling for a cart right now, she said. It's gonna take us a while to get packed, make sure we got everything. So where are you guys originally from? 
That yeah, no, that's well, really relevant, it man. It's it really relevant. Because we're, we're being discriminated, can you tell? Do you think it's rational what they're doing? That's your opinion. I paid two thousand over two thousand bucks to be here and I'll get treated like they this. You keep saying y'all you open the door, they open the door, they can check on y'all butt naked, we open the door. Uh, they open the door to check on us and we're butt naked. So we're not supposed listen, to be naked in our room. The, the wow, establishment, the establishment that's that's why we're being kicked out. Because here. they opened the door to come in our room and we're naked. <laughs> well, you know, that's fine. We're definitely, ah, oh, we're definitely gonna handle it. So, I just wanted it all on record because you know, people don't. We give them a rope, they'll hang it on self. So, club quarters will definitely compensate us for. This discrimination, embarrassment, harassment. Yeah, on New Year's Day, right? So called New Year's Day. She barged in my room and I'm, I'm naked. That's what the police just said. This doesn't look much like a hotel room. It's definitely a condo that we've been paying to be here. You see, they had to give us a free night because they were harassing us so much. One of the people gave us a free night, and now they're retaliating and saying, "Oh, you gotta stay." If we're so bad, why did they give us a complimentary you deal with night? That company, I don't have nothing to say about that. Yeah, you no, deal with that I'm talking to, I'm, lawyer. I'm talking to my lawyer on oh, camera okay. right here. All right. Well, I'm, I'm recording. Yes. Yeah. The entire time, Richard, they've been trying to create a controversy for no reason. Richard, this Megan woman right here. You're going to see how much fun she has in court when her time comes. I need a bag for these groceries. Laundry bags. So the, they like little grocery bags. These people are mentally ill. Stalking us, harassing us, threatening us, embarrassing us, discriminating. We will have our remedy. Have a car in ballet that you would like for them to pull? <sighs> Sir? Please, that's how you're This letter Do just she retarded. Don't even talk to her. She's got a mental problem. She's probably part of some cult here that's helping, that's saying to do all of this to us. So, you see. You guys should definitely pick who you make your battles with.
and that's not the entirety of the reservation. The rest is on a whole nother website. Are you sure? Uh, excuse me, that was all right. Do you have a business card with the incident number? I'm going to sue you so hard, it won't be funny.